We really want to leave the apartment, but we're not sure if we can leave the apartment because we keep on getting emails saying there's going to be a delivery coming today and we don't know what time because they don't say on the email. Nope. And we want to leave the house right now because we want to unbox all of this, but we can't because we don't have a toolkit. We don't have a drill because I'm assuming that we need, we need screwdrivers. Uh, we need Allen keys, like flathead screwdrivers. I'm oh surprised you even know this name. The reason why we're a little bit hesitant to leave is because one of our parcels were stolen the other mm. week, like two weeks ago. Yep. Yeah. So we got a bar cart and it was quite expensive. It was like $250 and it was stolen. So we have a little robber in the apartment. A little shit. We got it from Temple and Webster and they are so lovely. Like they're so easy to get in contact with and they're literally giving us another bar cart. We are back from the tool place and the PO box and we are really hot. We put the aircon on and when we came back, it was so nice. So good to walk into. We went to this shop, it's called Total Tools. And we also met someone at this shop as well. She was so lovely. Her name's Alana, if she's watching this. We'll give you a quick haul. I don't know, because so it's boring. Not sure if you're interested in this, because it's just Actually, tools. if you're after a tool kit at home, this is how you make it. This is what you do. So we got pliers. We got this screwdriver set. So it's got all the different screwdrivers and stuff. We got two extension leads and we also got this we're going to put it around the lounge because we want floor lamps behind our couches. It's really hard because we only have one PowerPoint in the living room and only on the TV side. So we have to like put an extension lead all the way to the lounge to get the lamps on. Anyway. Yay. We also got a hammer. Oh, yeah. In case I get really angry at Jazz. No. <laughs> uh, we got a, what do you call them? Stud finder. Stud finder. I feel really smart saying like, oh, it's a stud finder. You know, so it finds you can... the studs in the walls for nailing an art. A tape measure, finally. It looks really good because the numbers are really big and you can see it. Easy to read. Mm -hmm. And we got a, what is this? I don't know really, what's it called? Look at these little lines on it. You just snap one off to make it sharper. Like, don't snap it off with your hands. No, it's no, got you the have thing this. On the end. Yeah, he showed us and you just like put it in my like lines. You just it. let this unboxing begin. We're gonna start with I Love Linen. It's a bit of a boring package because I'm pretty sure there's like pillows and dunes and stuff. But we have one, two, three, four, five boxes from I Love Linen. We needed to get like for visitors. So when we get visitors, we needed some sheets and we needed doona pillows. Like there's actually a lot to think about catering for visitors. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, it's good, eh? Wow. You can have a go next. Careful. So we have queen bed sheets and single bed sheets. And they're both in this beautiful yellow color. Look at that. It's linen. So it's got that, I love the material of linen. We weren't really sure if we should get a bed sheet and a fitted sheet, because we feel like that's a waste. I never sleep under a flat sheet. I only sleep on my fitted sheet and a doona over the top. I didn't want to waste my money. I didn't get a flat sheet. I got a fitted sheet and then I've got the doona cover that's coming. So my fitted sheet, I got in this daisy color. It's called daisy. It's a yellow. I've got queen because my bed's queen. She's a queen. And the reason we have single is because we're getting a single lounge, like a single little couch, and that's going to be another visitor area. To so sleep we got on. a single sofa pullout and a queen sofa pullout coming. When I look at bed inspo, everyone has four pillows. So I got myself two extra pillows so I can have the whole aesthetics of like the <laughs> full bed look. Renee also got a big doona. Did you show them this? That's my big doona, isn't it? A big quilt. Who else calls it doona? Is it doona or is it quilt? So I got this quilt from the I Love Linen website. It's called the Hotel Cloud Collection. And they also have pillows, which I also picked up, but this is what the big doona looks like. I need to pull it out and see if it's puffy because I really want my doona to be like big. I'm guessing it is because it says hotel cloud and I'm hoping it's just like the hotels. So you know when you go to a hotel and you're like, where is this nice. doona cup from? Oh, oh my crazy. God, you don't even have to press down. Oh, the pillows. Ooh. One, two, three, four, five, five. We've got six pillows. Six pillows. Love. Two more pillows. Renee spent way too much money on a lamp. It's from Bougie. The thing is, we don't know if we're gonna put this in our lounge room or Renee's room. Obviously, if it's going in the lounge room, I'll put in for it. <gasps> I knew it was gonna be like Holy this. Holy shit, that's big. This is what the lamp looks like, and it's really light. It comes with four bulbs, <laughs> like this. Really easy, actually. Okay, oh, and then you just turn it on. Three, two, one. Oh, what? Oh. Ready, three, yeah. two, one. That does not look the same in this camera. That looks, that looks yellow, but it's bright it's really orange. Okay, we just got a parcel from Gigi and Tom. Gigi and Tom are so lovely. They saw our video and they saw that one of our candles were broken, like it must've cracked in the Australia Post. So they resent the candle, this candle. You would have already seen it before. There it is. And then they also saw that a barcode must've got confused because they're moving warehouses. So we didn't get our colander that we asked for, but now look, we got it. <laughs> so we got some living room lamps. You may not like our lamp because it might look like pipe work. That's what Jazz said. Looks now, like plumbing. Now that's all I can see. <laughs> no, George had told me that actually. Oh. No, the shade is adorable. Oh, that's beautiful. This is the base and it's gold. So we got these lamps from a place called Freedom. Best bit is this little dangly thing here. Wait, can I pull it? And here she is. 
This is what the table lamp looks like. To turn it on, you just go like that. You just pull that. We don't have a bulb yet, so. We also have a floor lamp, which looks exactly the same. Excuse the mess, but here are the lamps together. So we've got the floor lamp and the table desk lamp. Are they giving retro? We're not really sure. But yeah. We're now gonna unbox our lounge side tables. Holy shit, they're already put together. Oh, they're big. <laughs> Look, they're already made. Whoa. What do you think of them? They look like this. And they're a marble. That's marble. And it's the same as our kitchen bench. Like exactly the same, pretty much. Last package of the day. We're unboxing our bar stools. We got two bar stools, extremely retro. They're kind of giving American diner, but that's fine. Now nah, this is the most exciting part, the little the seat. Careful. No way, that's no way. They are sick. They're perfect. They're like chocolate colored. Oh my God, I love that. Oh, and they're big too. Like, Wow. Big bum. Wait, is yours different? <sighs> Why are they doing the instructions like this? No, so that's not gonna work. Look, you want these to connect. See those things? 30 minutes later, the sun is down, hence why the lighting is horrible. I don't know, I don't know what's going on with the camera, it's... but we are orange. We've set up one stool. It took 30 minutes, but now that we know what to do with it, I feel like this one will be quicker. Oh, that's comfy and it's got a backrest. Yeah? Yeah. I'm, I'm so comfy, spin me round. Woohoo! Oh, oh that's, that's comfy. Good afternoon, happy Thursday. It's currently 1.22 in the afternoon and I literally just got changed doing my hair, finished my makeup. I always do this. I always like get ready right at the end of the day. I'm really sorry, this angle is really distracting. My side profile looks, I didn't know it looked that bad. Let's move this way a little bit. I keep biting my nails. I do this when I'm stressed and I'm really stressed today because it's so late and we still have so much to do. Jazz and I have to film a video for a brand and it's 1.24. So we have literally three hours until the sun goes down and we need the lighting, like the good lighting to film the content. So I'm a little bit stressed. I need to stop picking up my nails, but like I can't help it. I've got like little shards coming off my nails. I just need to like... Anyways, the reason why we're running late is because of this new app that has just come out called Threads and Instagram app. And I've just been on it. It's a brand new app and I was like so curious. And there's like so many people on it. It's so random. Like I don't even know what the app is. It's kind of like Twitter, but it's bringing back memories of when I first got social media for some reason. Like it's really nostalgic at the moment because it's brand new. Everyone's jumping on it and like really excited and it's just like so random. But anyways, I'm trying to pick an outfit um, to wear today because we are filming a branded content. So I don't want an outfit that has like a big brand logo on it because some brands actually don't like you having like it feels like Nike or something. I just put this outfit on. I'm trying to decide if I want to wear this today. No logo showing. Bit of a brown look. Thing is, this branded TikTok that we're doing, we have to cook. And I don't like wearing long sleeves when I'm cooking. But it might be okay because they're staying up when I do like when I do this. We do have to go to Woolworths for this branded TikTok. But we're a bit worried about the sun going down. So we're thinking we're going to film us cooking. And then we'll do Woolies another time. If you're wondering, this is from White Fox. This is from the Universal store. And these pants are from Cotton On. They're really nice. I always get compliments on them. For perfume, I'm going to go with the Ariana Grande. And we have Billie Eilish. This one smells like vanilla. Can't forget my lip liner and my lip balm. I'm literally doing this in the camera. Okay, I actually really struggled to find an outfit that didn't have a logo on it because basically all my clothes have logos on it. This one's from Petal and Pop and I've just paired it with some jeans. I'm doing a collaboration with Greens and Goodness. It's a healthy plant-based option. So it does like nuggets, schnitzels, burger patties, all that stuff. And then when they sent me the package, which I got all the frozen meals in the freezer, they sent me this little esky and they put an apron in there. And it's actually a really nice one too. It's a denim material. Package is here. Oh, so yeah, we've got a package arrive. We're off to the lobby to get it because someone will steal it. Perfect timing. We just got our knives delivered and we literally had to chop up stuff today to, for the collaboration. I had to chop up stuff and we have no knives. We got knives from Baccarat because we heard that they have the best knives, but we're not really sure. We got a set of three different sizes. They were on special too. Ooh, knives can get up there, like really expensive. That's really sharp. We also got a sharpener just in case. But we got one of these ones because you can either get the sharpener where you have to go like that and it's got the big wand. Or this one looks a beginner's sharpener person because I wouldn't know how to use that sharpener. And you have to go through the three slots. Cool, we got our nice. knives. Oh, where are we going to put them on? Yeah. What the fuck did we just say? I just want you to put that there. And then I'll put another one. All right, we just finished up filming that TikTok. I'm so full. These are plant-based nuggets and they taste amazing. My sister and I try and take turns cooking dinner, but today we are not bothered and we're not getting takeout. So we went to Woolworths to try and find something super easy, but healthy. We like to eat primarily plant-based. So we picked up the Greens and Goodness Spicy Bombay Tenders. We totally forgot to show you something very exciting that we opened yesterday. I feel really rude. We opened it with TikTok. We totally forgot about you guys. 
very exciting purchase that we made. We're just looking at it. It doesn't look good until it's on, to be honest. If you well, follow us on TikTok, you probably already know about it, but actually Jazz, you have to turn it on. Okay. And action. Ta-da! <laughs> That's our new addition to the apartment, the neon light. We got this one from Christian Hull's merch. He's a TikToker. And yeah, he made that, so we got that. I love yeah. it, the colors are perfect. So it's currently 4.50 in the afternoon. It's almost five o'clock, which is happy hour, drink hour, actually I think happy hour's at four. We are literally only planning to go to Woolies to film that little clip that we needed for Jasmine's TikTok. Yeah. And then we ended up buying drumsticks, dessert. We got some salted caramel and some mint drumsticks. We also got uh, extension lead and then a pack like a flat pack thingy. Oh yeah, we got lollies to fill our little lolly bowl that we have on a coffee table. It was actually meant to be a salad bowl, but now it's a lolly bowl. So that's kind of funny. <laughs> so we got these ones. These are my favorite and they're really colorful. They're gonna look really good in the bowl. We made sure that we got lollies that were covered and not open. So like ants can and like, you know, covered lollies. Oh, these are exciting. These remind me of childhood. These are like little milk chews. I think they're called chew mix. Look, Sherby's. Oh, Sherby's. Anyways. Got those ones. We got some Pascal's. I love these. We've got the chocolate in there. We also got some eclairs. Which are better, Pascal's or eclairs? We also got minties. Can't go wrong with those. We also got some sweet chili. We already have sweet chili, but we're actually sick of trying to pour our sweet chili. It ends up like, cause it comes with just a screw lid and it ends up just falling out mm. onto the meal. And we thought, why don't we get a squeezy one? We also picked up some glass wipes, which is not sustainable one bit, but when we were trying to wipe the glass, like our coffee table, cause it gets so dirty quickly. Mm. We didn't really realize, but I don't regret it. I still love our coffee table, but it just gets really dirty. So we picked up some of these glass wipes. So we're going to give them a go. <laughs> I, I always laugh when I say glass wipes. I don't... <laughs> Renee got some toothpaste. It was literally on special that I just grabbed it. Like, yeah, I was like, yeah, whatever. And I got some chewing gum and that is it. Renee got a little parcel. Oh, I got a parcel. The funny thing is we were just about to head back to our apartment and then Renee accidentally clicked down on the elevator. Accidentally, I was meant to press up. And, and then we looked at each other after I pressed down and we're like, we're meant is to it meant to be? Down? Do we need to check the ground level to see even though, if we have a parcel? Even though we didn't get notified that we had a parcel arrive, but we're like, you know, let's just follow our gut. The universe made you click the down arrow. And there it was. And there it is. And Renee didn't get notified that she had a parcel and this is Ooh. pricey. Yes, it's my lava lamp. I have not seen one of these in a million years. You are going to want one, Jazz. Oh, really? Yup. The beauty's in here. Oh, the glitter in it. Whoa. Oh, this is wicked. Whoa. Heats up. That is really cool. So this is what it looks like when it's not on, which is like, it looks really strange. Oh, look. <laughs> you can get different colors, I'm pretty sure. Actually, uh, you can't on bougie.com. I didn't get to choose. Actually, could I? I literally can't remember, but. And look, you actually have to touch the bowl. It won't work. The bowl? Yeah. Put the light on. Where do you put the bowl? Probably under it. Oh, it is. Yeah. Comes with a little bulb. And that's not plugged oh, in or anything. Baby. And then this just sits on top. Yeah. Oh, really? Yep. Let's see this thing. It takes a while to like heat up. Yeah, I know. You can't wait for it to do thing. We totally forgot about the lava lamp and it's, look at it. It looks so good. I love it. What even is it? Okay, I don't know why I look so orange, but we're just about to go to bed. It's 10.30 at night. I haven't vlogged on my own in so long. It feels so weird. This is the book that I'm currently reading. I'm up to the last book and I'm really sad. The last book of the Akator series. I just finished this one last night. I don't know why it was so small. These books are really good. If you have not started reading them, I actually envy you because I wish I could just get it out of my brain so I can reread it because it's so fucking good. They're quite romantic, which is why I love it. I love romantic books. I think the next series I'm going to read is called The Glass of Thrones or Thrones of Glass. The Thrones of Glass, I think they're called. Apparently they're less romantic, which I'm not looking forward to, but it's the same author. So I'm going to read her next series, but it's an eight book series. I always try and read two chapters a night. Renee's reading her two chapters now. She's actually reading the same series and she's up to book three. Honestly, this is my favorite time of the day is when I get to read my book and just relax. So that's what I'm going to do right now. Good morning. I'm pretty sure I just fixed the lens. I'm not orange anymore. All I had to do was press white balance. I don't know. Let's have some coffee and see if Renee's awake.
clothes line for the first time. We got this one from Bunnings and it's in like this rose gold color. I also have some really good news. So you know that lamp over there? I got it from Bougie Core. I unboxed that lamp on TikTok and the Bougie company saw it and then they emailed me and was like, thank you, like, do you mind if we use your video and we'll give you a $300 gift voucher for their store? I, I got this too. from there too. They got such retro stuff and it's a little business as well and they're just like really good quality. So we we're gonna like save up for the chairs on their website and, but then I was like, oh my God, I've been eyeing off your chairs. I love them so much. They're like foldable ones and they've got like a little imprint for your butt and they've got two different colors, like literally so retro. I told her, I was like, I've been eyeing off the chairs and then she was like, you know what, we'll send you two of your chairs. Like, oh my god, like, I got so excited. Oh, also, we've taken a few photos with this. What are we up to on this? I just want to get them delivered already. So curious. We've got 36 photos to take. 36, and we've only taken six. That's it's okay. kind of stressful taking photos on this thing because you only get the one take and you can't even see if it's a good photo. So I'm like, yeah. and then it's like, what, ready, set, go. And it's going to look so bad because I've been doing this. Doing this for so long. Doing this. But we took one in the kitchen. It was dark. It was darkest. It was dark last night, obviously. And we took a photo in the kitchen <laughs> and I wanted to see what it's going to look like. I want it to look that. You know when um, you see those old photos and it's just really flash because it's in a dark area? Or I in a bathroom, it. like really vibey. Vibey. Oh, I hope it it's like probably going to be like a big blurry blob, but anyway. No. <laughs> morning and we just did a big clean of the house like we did a vacuum I cleaned the bathroom just did a bit of a clean so we know we're having visitors over oh yeah we didn't even tell you our dad's coming this weekend they're all coming here to see Violet for the first time meeting Violet which yeah. is really exciting it's really so. cool. but we're gonna go to the Gold Coast tomorrow to spend the weekend with them because they are also staying in the Gold Coast but we're just about to jump on a call with our manager All right, I just finished doing my voiceover for that TikTok and it's all sent off. I've emailed my manager. I feel really good that that's done. This here is my new Duna cover. Renee actually doesn't like this. She's like, I don't understand why you like the, the Duna cover, doesn't it? I'm going to open it right now and I'm going to put it on my bed. I'm really keen because I'm really sick of seeing that blue. It's like, it's a pretty Duna. Like, I love the one I have, but like, you know, when you just keep seeing it, you get bored. Sometimes literally all you need is to change a Duna cover and you feel like a new person. It comes in this little tote bag. How cute is that? Look how it's wrapped so pretty by the way these are from delacours it looks like that look it comes in a pack it's got sheets and pillowcases and this is actually really affordable i think it's because it's not linen linen is where it gets really pricey so the vibe that i'm going for in this room is kind of like english cottage but also kind of like vintage and then also old-fashioned like kind of like the lounge room but i'm gonna make it more vintage rather than retro i do prefer like a darker sheet for some reason it just makes me more sleepy when i'm sleeping in a dark color see Dark and it matches with the frill. Oh, these are the pillows. Aren't they beautiful? I don't actually sleep with sheets, but I'm gonna use this as like a fitted sheet. So I'm gonna like tuck it in and do my little hospital corners. I also got all these new pillows. So I'm going to change these pillows, change those over because they're like so grubby. We just got another delivery and it's beanbag stuffing. Not that exciting, but it kind of is. <laughs> now we can actually sit on this thing. Cause at the moment we our butt sticks right to the floor. <gasps> we got two beanbag stuffings. Um, I'm pretty sure, I don't know how many liters. We originally just got one and it was too flat. So we got two extra ones, but we're just gonna put one in, see if it's enough. And then obviously. Ooh. Oh wow, it's already blown up. Quick, Wait, this one's way better. Quick. Oh shit, we put too much in there, haven't we? Is it? Wait, don't all it. Oh. oh! That's what you want. Is it actually good? Yeah, yeah, it's good. It's not 
This looks like shit. Oh, yeah, wow. Fuck yeah. Why does Jasmine get the bean bag? That's all right. It's actually, we could probably fit two on here. You actually can. Yeah, no, this is all right. We have another parcel to unbox with you. So it's not really unboxing, is it? It's an unwrapping. I'm actually really excited about this because it is tea towels from Adairs. So we got these ones from Adairs. And as you can see, they have very retro colors because we actually, we got tea towels, the linen ones that we got from Mosey Mose Me. Me. They're really beautiful, but they're not practical for tea towels. They're not drying our hands. So hoping that these ones are more practical and they do look really pretty. That's Let's open them. Wow, I love this tea towel. I love this one. That's nice. And then we have this one. That's my favorite. It goes with our towel. It goes oh, with our towels. It does. We also got some washers. No, nah, they're actually, what are they called? Uh, dishcloths. Dishcloths. So we got these washable ones. Oh, they're beautiful. They feel really nice. Don't you reckon? Yeah, I love that. And they're small, just like you like it. I wonder what oh. they're made of. <laughs> these say Adair's Retro Floral Cotton Bamboo Tea Towels. We've got another little parcel here. It's from Le Cura Skincare. If you guys are the OG and been following us on YouTube for a very long time, like back in the day, this is our first like skincare brand that we found and loved. That and made it cured Renee's acne. It did, basically, yeah. Ooh, oh, this is the new. They have sunscreen. Le Cura just come out with sunscreen. Oh, I'm excited. Whoa. SPF 50 natural face sunscreen. Le Cura. This is so weird looking at a new product from Le Cura. This makes me excited. It does. Free from chemicals, safe for acne problematic skin, for sensitive skin as well. Oh, I love the packaging. Gotta smell it. Oh, smells actually, very natural. Oh my God, that reminds me of something. Because of the natural oils, it gives you a glow. Look at that. I think what I can smell is the sunflower oil. And we also got these two products. We've got Hydra Boost Serum and the Overnight Purifying Gel. Get a little bit on your finger, dab it on your pimple, dries out the pimple. Next day, she's ready to go. She's so lovely, thank you. Watching. Bianca, if you're watching this, thank you so much. This was so unexpected. I went down to the lobby. I saw this parcel. You remember the dried daisies that we got? It was from a little brand called Know the Rose. So I think she sent me a gift. What has she gotten us? Oh, she wrote us a little name. Aww. Oh, this is just a little gift for your new bedrooms. Whoa. <gasps> they are so pretty. Oh my God. I love them so much. These are so pretty. They're gorgeous. Wow. These are called the posies, she said. That is going to go perfectly in my room with my doona. We just filmed a TikTok of us unboxing our throws because our throws arrived. That's going in the living room and we're going to put it in this basket. The basket we got from the antique store and look how big it is and well we're hoping it's big enough to fit all the throws that we got we got four throws to put in there we're gonna roll it up in little sausages so you can see all the different colors before we roll them up we just want to show you all the throws that we got in there so this is the first one this is a green one we've got a bit of green in the living room and this is the texture of it and it's really soft as well like i love the different like colors through it this is the next one so this is a pink one it's a very light pink it almost looks white and it's in like a different because we wanted different textures different, different texture colors throws. yeah this one has dogs on it this is the softest one out of all of them. Fluffy doggies on them. This look, is the soft. I love the softest this is my one. favorite one. This is my favorite one. Yeah. And look, this is not white. It's like this brown color. And then the last one we got is this big cream colored fake fur. She is overflowing. Look at that. <laughs> so we got some camper chairs just in case visitors come over and like a lot of visitors come over and we have no more seats. We don't actually have camper chairs, so I feel like we need them in our life. You know, we're an adult now. Everyone should have a camper chair. We got some UV ones too. <laughs> Let's give it a go, eh? We used to go on lots of camping trips with the family and mum bought us these tiny little camper chairs that I feel like they were kind of cheap as well. And I would look at these chairs and I would be jealous because Same. like the adults had the nice chairs, the comfy right. ones, but now we got the nice adult chairs. <sighs> They smell good too, eh? Oh, this is brilliant. Comes a little stubby cooler. Oh, get out of the We have an esky on the side. They have an esky. <laughs> like a cooler bag, not an esky, a cooler bag. You can put ice in there with your drinks. We got these chairs from BCF. Those these ones that were like double the price and they had, a, it was a seat warmer. Like it literally had heat packs <laughs> in the back of the chair. Okay, we're just about to unbox something else. Don't mind Renee in the back with her shirt up. She has a bit of like acne on her back, just in one spot. She put tea tree on my back, so I'm just letting it dry mm. we got a little shelf what's well, actually a desk it's supposed to be a makeup desk but we're not using it as a makeup desk we're using it as a water filter desk we're to put our water filter on hey we're just on facetime with ben and georgia we're on yeah. facetime do you want to say hello to the youtube vlog there's ben <laughs> they keep yeah. us updated on violet all the time we miss her we haven't seen her in like two weeks two weeks yeah. nah jokes probably week <laughs> feels like two weeks because ben's on there we're gonna unbox something electronic it's the uh sony speaker oh. It's bigger than I expected. Yeah, that's what she said. Here it is. So you just chuck it right in front of the TV, eh? Ben, we have two cables here. Wait, so we can just play music on our phone and then boom, it comes out the sonus. <gasps> yeah. Oh my, that's deep. Hold it down, yeah. and then go your settings. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> it looks so sick. Yeah, that sounds really good. Wait, let's play one song with a bit of beat. <laughs> 
Good morning. We've gotten up pretty early this morning. It's about seven o'clock. So we're about to get ready to go see our family. Our Sydney family arrived, dad and everyone. We're actually gonna have a shower and wet my hair and then I'm going to blow dry it straight. I feel like it's just easier to maintain when it's straight because I think we're sleeping over at George's tonight. It is an hour from here and I don't wanna have to go here, back, back, back. So we're just gonna pack a little suitcase. Anyway, I'm gonna open this like little suction things like i'm gonna put it on the wall and then stick my toothbrush i was gonna get one of those like cup things but every time i get one of them my toothbrush gets wet and then i stick it in there and then all the water goes down and then snip if you smell it it's disgusting it ends up smelling like vomit so i've got my sink here and then the mirrors i'm thinking of putting it under here and i also have three more here so when people come over i'm going to stick them on here so everyone else can put their toothbrushes along here and then i also got all these toothbrushes for when visitors come over if they forget the toothbrush it's always good to have backup apparently it's normal to lose a thousand hairs a day and if you don't brush your hair for like two days that means like two thousand hairs are coming out Okay, hair is done. It actually didn't take as long as I thought it would. It's still a little bit frizzy, I think. I'm gonna put some oil in it. I'm gonna use some of this Jizo, Jizo. All right, I'll see you when my makeup's all done. Makeup is done and this is the outfit. I wasn't gonna wear a skirt, but I thought, why not? Just waiting on Renee. Good morning, I'm really lazy to grab the tripod. Actually, I'm gonna show you what this camera is doing right now. You are leaning up on my drink bottle and I am surprised that you're not falling right now. The tripod's out there and I literally, it's like a big tripod and I don't wanna bring it in here. Anyways, I'm currently getting ready. Jazz and I are leaving the apartment. She's probably already spoken to you and told you everything that's happening today. I packed my bags in a bit of a rush this morning. I woke up a little bit late and I was like, oh my God, I haven't packed. I need to have a shower. I need to do my hair. You know how long it takes me to do my hair because I've got curly hair. Putting on my sunscreen. Yeah, this is like a really bad angle. Hello. Fine, I'm just gonna get my tripod. Jazz and I are driving to the Gold Coast this morning. We are seeing our dad, our stepmom, stepsister, stepbrother. We're staying in a hotel on the Gold Coast. So we're gonna go to that hotel. It's literally winter and I'm sweating. Like I was diffusing my hair and I felt a drip drip down under my armpit. I'm trying to decide if I wanna film a TikTok. I haven't really been very good at filming my get ready with me's on TikTok. I used to do them every single day and now I'm slack and I don't do it anymore. I ran out of my Kosas concealer, but I realized that there's actually a little plastic top on top of it. There you go. Look at all of that concealer. <laughs> We got home last night. We spent a day on the Gold Coast. And now we're just waiting on dad and Lisa to come here because they're spending two days in Brisbane and we're showing them around. I wanted to like put these around the house. It's a little present that Lisa and dad got us. So sweet, a housewarming gift. So grateful and I want to show you what they got us. So all this is from Dusk and it's a lighter and then it's also got a snipper. It's rose gold. They also got us this little thing that puts the candle out. How cute is this? Like a little bell. This is so pretty. It's a trinket with a leaf. I'm trying to work out what we should put on this because it's so beautiful. They also got us these little tea light candle holders, little flowers. Goes perfectly in our apartment. And we actually got candle little lights as well. And these smell so good. They also got us this little trinket dish. So cute. It looks like a little lily pad. I don't know what to put in this. Maybe like keys. These are stunning. They are candles. This one here has sparkles. How beautiful is that? And they got us this little card. Look, it's got like boxes and like chairs. Like it's full moving out card. We also got these two little presents. Oh, she's written a hand note. Beth. Beth has a small business. Donates 25% of funds to EDFA, an organization that educates oh. how to better support their loved ones who suffer from eating disorders. Eating disorders. The name Stitched and Loved, and she's um, capitalized the ED for eating disorders. No way. She knows us so well. Oh my God, Hazelnut's got our favorite chocolate. Oh my God, I love these socks. What are yours? Oh. Oh my god, I love the colors. So beautiful. <gasps> no way. What is it? Sagittarius earrings. Oh my god, are they? Top gun? Oh my god. No way. How did you get that so quickly? I love them so much. Oh, they're sick. Thank you so much. Will we borrow them? What are yours, Sagittarius? Sagittarius. She knows that I love star signs. Look at them. <laughs> and she made these top gun earrings. That's sick. Like the, oh, so cute. I love quirky earrings. I love quirky things. <laughs> no way. Oh my god, I love them. We've got a little plant-based chocolate. Yeah. Ah, that's so that beautiful. That pea. How beautiful is that? You are you enough. You are enough. And it's purple. Because you deserve to be happy. <laughs> Look, it's a it's pea. A pea. Be happy. And it's a pea. Handmade things are so much more special. Look at that. 
I'm gonna read this card now, but if you're watching this, thank you so much. Like, you mean so much to us. Honestly, this has literally made me so happy. Yeah, we love you so much. We have another parcel. Sorry, it's really loud. We just opened the doors because we have our dad and step stepmom coming here really soon. And we don't want our apartment to smell really stuffy, so we're just opening it up to get some fresh air in. Oh my god, yes. Okay, this is inspired by Nen. our Nen. So whenever we go to our Nen and Pa's, we get takeout and they get these big trays to put takeout on so we can eat in the living room without spilling it. So we were like trying to find big trays. It took us ages to find some. And look what we found. Jazz found these colorful. Colorful. Put your little takeout dish, <laughs> put it on your lap, watch TV. We got them from the house. house. This one is very exciting. We think that this is our bar cart. That should have arrived a month ago, but it was stolen because it was left in the wrong spot. Here it is. Oh, God, this looks complicated. This is actually a little out. We're in a rush because they're coming here any minute. Thank goodness our dad and stepmom turned up just as the lounge arrived because there was eight boxes that we had to put in the elevator and bring up to our apartment. Eight boxes. Can you imagine Jazz and I doing that all on our own? Dad and Lisa, if you're watching this, thank you so much. We appreciate you. So the lounges that we got were gifted from Koala. Jazz and I literally cannot believe it because we were going to purchase these two exact lounges and then Koala reached out and we were like, oh my God. So yeah, thank you so much, Koala. We are honestly so grateful. Okay, these lounges do look really hard to put together because they do come in eight boxes, but they were actually really simple to put together. Literally, there was no tools required. It was just using your hands, like turning a couple of knobs on the um, bottom of the lounge like the legs and yeah we had these lounges put together within like 20 minutes I would say maybe less we wanted our lounges to pull out into sofa beds because we don't have a spare bedroom and we're gonna have visitors quite a lot and we just want them to sleep on a comfortable bed so we got the koala cushy sofa bed in the queen and the single I was not expecting the single sofa bed to be so big like you can literally sit two people side by side like easy there is so much room we are so happy with how these lounges have turned out they look amazing in our living room I was not expecting it to look this good our dad and stepmom also helped us put our bar cart together it was a little bit tricky, but once it was put together, it looks so good. Our living room is basically done. The only thing that we're waiting for is our TV, which is, should be coming next week, but it's basically done. So here is the before and here is the after.